What's good? It's your boy, Urban Legend, K Bird, KG USA representative all day in the building. And today, we're going to be talking about the company name Song Trader. That's Song Trader. If you never heard of Song Trader, I'm about to put y'all up on some free fucking game. Let's get into it. Song Trader is a music licensing company. You know what I mean? They help artists that, you know, got their shit together pretty much. You know what I mean? Because they help you with your publishing and they help you get opportunities and they help you, you know, find placements. And they had a lot of artists that's been successful in the music industry fuck with them. Major artists and independent artists as well. I mean, they got artists like uh, Dizzy Wright. He co-signed them, give them a good tag. The band, I See Stars, they co-signed them. They gave them business. And from what they all say, you know what I mean? They had success using this company. Also, they help you get like songs cleared, like the legit way, like if you got a sample or something that you use from the past that's really dope and it was a classic record, they can help you get that shit cleared the real way so you can license it. That's why they call Song Trader, because you know what I mean? They help you trade your songs to get revenue off your publishing. You know what I mean? They give you a lot of different avenues and opportunities to submit your music to. You know what I mean? They be looking for music for like in a gym or music at a stadium, music in a cafe, music at a restaurant. And once you get that joint leased or somebody want to license it or somebody want to, you know, invest in it, you get royalties and paid off that. So that's a good thing. Now that's all for the starter plan, the free plan. Now we're going to talk about the light plan. The light plan is $19 a year, pretty much $20 a year, and you're going to get unlimited distribution for one artist. You're going to keep 100% of your royalties. You can bring your UPC codes, you know what I mean, from your old songs or old distributor and have no problem with keeping all your views, your streams, and your royalties. And you also get more opportunities with your publishing. You know what I mean? A lot of the fucking criteria for these placements they offering is very exact, you know what I mean? Very, very exact. They be wanting the music to be a specific way for a specific type theme. And, you know, you gotta be exact to it. But the opportunities are good though. And the reasons why they're good, they're putting your music in different places to get different exposure. Like certain businesses get funded a certain amount of money every year for that type of shit, you know what I mean? Every year. They get that kind of money up front for free. So, you know, it's an opportunity for artists to get something. It's not a big pot, but it's still a way to make money off your publishing. If you just get money off your streams and you ain't getting nothing off having your song published, you never got a publishing check. They also monetize all your YouTube, everything like that. Check your analytics. They give you more updates and they let you be able to see more of the information that you need for you to understand how your publishing and how your royalties working. Now the next tier is the own and control your music tier. And this is the one that's $49 a year, $50 a year pretty much. But this is the one that give you the full package, like everything. All the shit about distributing the music. You can have multiple artists. Let me see how many artists it is. Uh, I think it's like up to like five artists, but it's like multiple artists, all the publishing credits, the full package, you know what I mean? Everything you get to the distribute your music, you get to license your music, you get to control everything and get more opportunities. And a lot of these opportunities gonna help you, you know what I mean? Cause you can get bigger opportunities like basketball stadium opportunities, football stadium opportunities, soccer stadium opportunities. Ain't just in the US, it's international, you know what I mean? And the opportunities with the video games and the NBA and football, you know what I mean? All those kind of opportunities, you get those chances to get your music in that spot, you know what I mean? You fit the criteria, they probably will select that shit. But they do all type of music though. It ain't just like hip hop bass, you know what I mean? It's mostly like band bass. Like they be having even gospel music up there, you know what I mean? People need gospel music for the damn movie, like some Tyler Perry shit, you know what I mean? Or some rock and roll music, some fight music for a movie scene, you know what I mean? And that shit got cheaper, you know what I mean? They're going out there like they used to do back in the day and 
having the real soundtracks and shit like that. They still do that sometime nowadays, but most of the time, man, the music that you hear in movies, television, the shit you be hearing in bars, fucking elevators, all that shit been like picked or generated through like these forms, these digital platforms. And it's always a way to touch that shit without actually being in communication with those people and get you some money off that shit, you know what I mean? You get your song licensed, you get money off your streams and your license, you know what I mean? You get money off the shit that's getting played, you ain't hear it or none of that shit, but you receiving royalties off that, and that's a good thing. And also, man, I've been watching this guy video on YouTube, man, there's been a lot of success stories about people that had their music at these little cafes, and then they shit started getting more TikTok videos. You know what I mean? That one song they had that got played over there, that one night, maybe somebody was really fucking with it and did a TikTok video to it. And it was accessible and it was easy and it was quick. And that's what you need your shit to be. You need your shit to be a 